I am going to show you what what I bought at the house. So the first book was called As Simple as It Seems by Sarah Weeks. So this book was talking about Rabena. Um, she lives in a cruel family. His mother picked her when she was born, and his father was just mean. So after she met. Enter, enter, pooch. I guess it's that that name, which is kind of weird. Uh, so then she became a new self. So uh, it's a pretty interesting book. Okay, so let me. Uh, where do I put it? Here, I put it over here. I'll make you a separate pile. So uh, sorry about that. Sorry about that. Stop. So the next book was called Amber House. Two dollar fifty special value final price. After the half off, it's a dollar and twenty five cents. So it's basically talking about、uh, Sarah Parsons had never been to Amber House, and then. Uh, because um, his her brother Jackson dares her to find diamonds, and she just uh she just kind of go to the discover the secret of Amber House and and have to find diamonds for her mother's unhappiness and stuff. So this is an interesting book. It was by Kelly Moore, I guess. Okay, so move on. Oh wait, put it over here. The next. Book was called Rune. Rune is two dollars fifty. Ah,、uh, two dollars fifty is two dollar and fifty cents. So after it's half off, it's a dollar and twenty five cents. And it's talking about Rebecca. Um, she went to the grave and then had a friend called what was he? Uh, Lisette, 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 and Lisette was a ghost. So it's just talking about about、um, that was a story that her friend was a ghost. Yay! So it's like that. Okay, let's look at another. The another one is War Horse. This is the the book that I saw was interesting because it is written in、uh, a horse's perspective, which is、uh, kind of cool. I don't I don't know if it is, and it's by Michael Morpurgo. I guess it's a movie. I guess, but it's pretty interesting that Joby, um, the Joey or Joey, she's a he's he's a horse. Was in uh after World World War Two, he was uh he he won he he was wondering um why how when. Does World War Two end? So World War One. Okay, so she's just he's just waiting. So this is this book was telling about、uh, the friendships in wars of wars, a sort story that would dazzle dazzle readers from beginning to end. So pretty good book. Put it aside. The next one was Brett Crump. I found this book pretty interesting because it's in some of the series. So it's talking about Hazel. And Jack,、uh, they are not friends anymore after they are eleven years old. And then, and then Jack has been taken by what was the person? Oh, by a by a grandma into the woods by a woman, and lived made made of ice and been been taken in the woods. And then Hazel had to save. So that was a pretty good book. So Brett Crump, and I'm wondering why was the title Brett Crump, but I'll find out. The next one was Dewey. It's the number one New York best,、uh, New York Times bestseller. It's thirteen dollars and ninety nine cents, but after a half off, it's six dollars. It's talking about Dewey, this cat. He was a library cat, and people respected him. And it was a great book because it's New York Times bestselling. So just check it out. The next book was that I really found interesting was called Seven Wonders: The Colossus Rises by Peter Lerengus. Uh, the book was talking about um just one boy, 
Jack McKinley was going to die. Just one mission. He had to save the world. Just one problem. Um, the the seven magic was hidden around the world. Seven wonders. Uh, he was he just wanted to be a hero. So yeah, I found this book pretty interesting. That uh, it started out that Jack is going to die. So I just think this is oh that's interesting. Jack is going to die. Okay, so that was it for this. The next book was called Dream Sleeves. It's by Colin Murta Parator. It's talking about、uh, Aislin, which is kind of nicknamed A, and she her life was uneasy. Her dreams are challenging, so she has to, she she have to、uh, take care of、uh, she have to babysit instead of going pool in summer summertime, and she have to studying and stuff. And she 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 have to grab their dreams and beliefs. So this book is talking about. A、uh, dream sleeve is a story that will make readers dream and believe bigger than they ever imagined. So it's dollar ninety nine, special price cut into a、uh, dollar. Okay, so let me put this aside. The next book, oh, that was wrapped around and covered. So, uh, they had a bris. Uh, they have a necklace including. So it's nine dollars and ninety nine cents for both books, which is five dollars if um half half off, and it's three dollars for each book. Found this book interesting because it's in a bunch of books that about um the princesses in the past and something that look forward to, but. Don't know what was about. Here, I'll put it aside so I'll check it out later. This was the book of One Hundred Truths by Julie Schumacher. So, yeah, the title the the title sounds interesting, and this read the this piece of word in, in red was also interesting. Theodore Grumman was a liar. That grabs readers' attention to read this book. And she, it's pretty hard for her to write the truths、um, in her notebook. So,、um, and she doesn't want to share the truths because she's a liar. Remember? So, I found this pretty interesting, and it's like that.、Yeah. Okay. So the next book was the most interesting, White Dolphin by Gil Lewis. I always wanted to buy this, but then、uh, at Barnes and Noble found another book that's pretty interesting. So it was talking about the White Dolphin injured, and then、uh, who is it called? Kara and Felix. Kara and Felix is going to save the reef and save dolphins. That's a pretty cool book. Check it out. The next book was No Passengers Beyond the Point. This is a really interesting book, two dollar fifty, which is one dollar twenty five, actually. So it was talking about questions can be tricky things. So there's a rat called Tompkins. Yeah, Tompkins. She's a genius. She could always solve problems. But when they had been trapped into a city called Fallen Birds, then Tompkins couldn't even、uh, find a solution to the problem. So、um, they they are all trapped and they have to find a way home without using the map. And this book tells you like, and if your life at home wasn't perfect, can you sure you want to go back? So it's really questions. Pretty cool. Okay, so the next book was called Almost Home. It's a real good book. I've seen it and. Uh, uh, several times it was that Sugar's life had been bent up and struggling and homeless. So then Sugar had had a homeless dog, and then, and then uh she had she had been inspired by Mr. Bennett, which is her former teacher, to write poems and stuff. So this seems interesting by Jo Joan Baller. Okay. So the next book was called Shimmer, a dollar. So which is fifty cents for a book? It was by Alisa No. It was talking about really, really was dead, but she could be alive. She could be alive. So it says,、um, life goes on when she's died, dead. Okay. So the book was this. 
the last book. Was, oh, I just brought it. Okay, a dog called Homeless. This girl sees her can see her mother, which is her mother is dead by Sarah Lian. Okay, and this dog could also see her mother, her dead mother. So, but no one believe believe her, and so she and the dog um uh. Have to persuade the huge silver gray. Uh, uh, blah, 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 have to persuade that mom is still with them, and it was talking about touching a story of how one girl's friendship with a homeless dog can mend a family's heart. So that was all the book.